Hey guys, what's up? My name is Taylor Leos. For those of you who don't know me and for those of you who do, welcome back. Thanks for sticking around. So I'm here at the bottom of my floor in my bedroom today. I'm going to be showing you guys a brand called Black Bow. Black Bow is a pretty new swimwear company. Uh, they were founded in 2017. And they reached out to me and sent me a bunch of really cool free bikinis. And just because I got these bikinis for free does not mean that I'm going to embellish the brand or make them sound better than what they are. I said that before, but I just want to make sure that I disclaim that. So I got a bunch of bathing suits and I'm going to go through each one and tell you guys the pros and cons of them. And I'll do a little try on for you too. I made little montages of each bathing suit because it was a little less weird than just standing in my room in front of a camera half naked posing it just that I don't know if that's my vibe so I tried to be outside and like and also before we get started make sure that you guys tap that subscribe button check out my social media my Instagram is tay.marie I'll put it up here on the screen so you guys can get a little preview definitely follow me on there I'm relatively active not crazy active I don't have that much stuff to post about honestly but yeah and then you can also check out my snapchat right here and make sure that you check out black bow swim because their instagram is popping so everything came in this um box for me it's a really cute box it opens up like this and on the inside it says designed for the tropical soul that was super cute off the bat and i guess i'll start with the daisy patterned bathing suit the bottoms are called moderate bottoms in the color daisy days and so here's, I thought I just inside and out these. Okay. These bottoms are supposed to be less cheeky than their other options. And you guys know, like, America is now jumping on the bandwagon. And all these bathing suits are so cheeky nowadays. And honestly, I'm like, I don't know if I could wear that in front of my grandpa. You know what I'm saying? But I guess it depends on the event. But I wanted some moderate bottoms, too, that were a little bit fuller coverage. And this on the website, it says totally wearable in family outings. Your grandma would approve, which I thought was really cute. And then it also has a little scrunch on the butt. So it, you know, makes your cheeks look nice. And I must say, I must say, the quality on all these bathing suits are really, really good. Um, they go for $40 each item. So this is $40 and the top is $40. Um, but the quality is definitely there. It's double lined and the stitching is really good. Like, let me see if I can give you guys a nice close up. You guys can see the stitching looks really nice. Trust me, it's good. I know a good bathing suit when I see one because I have a million. So, yeah. And this is the top. It's called the Tona Twist Top in Daisy Days, of course. And you have adjustable straps and you also have adjustable waistband. I can never think of what that's called. But yeah, both things are adjustable, so you can make it more adjusted to you. Uh, I got two bathing suits that have this exact style, the Tona Twist Top. is really flattering for my size uh, chest. It just makes them look good. Like, there's no sort of padding in here. It's all just, it just fits your body the way that it should. And I think it's just really flattering for like medium to small sized boobs, which is what I think I have. Um, I got these in a size small and they fit. And they also said for the moderate bottoms, you can size down for a more cheeky look. So that worked out well for me. Um, you'll find out later on that I did not order all my sizes correctly, but I'll get into detail when we get there. So next, I'm going to show you guys the red bathing suits that I got. So first of all, do you guys see this color? Do you? Because it's amazing. These are the classic high-rise bottoms. I ordered a size small in these, and I probably should have gotten a medium because it doesn't really fit right when I try to put them up more. Um, but you can wear them mid-rise or high-rise, so just whatever you like better. These bottoms are really flattering. They're very cheeky, though. Here's the bum. So it's a little bit on the cheekier side, but hey, America's on that wave, so <laughs> who cares? And we're only young ones, you know? Show it while you got it. 
show it while you've got it. <laughs> Cause I'm not gonna look like this when I'm 40, I'll tell you that. <laughs> uh, so I got these bottoms and I got two different tops to go with. This is called the Stassi top. I adore it. Like I'm not kidding guys, I think that this top is so flattering, it might be my favorite. I haven't really decided yet, but it's so cute, very simple, and it just fits nice. And I don't know what it is about like a square shape with the cute little bows up here, but it just looks really amazing. And again, the quality's great, the color is really cute, so it's just a classic bikini. And cue the montage. A twirl. So I also got the Tona Twist Top in red that goes with those bottoms as well. So here's what that looks like. It's the same as the Daisy one that I already showed you guys. Again, adjustable straps on both the shoulder and the back. So that's always good. And this one, I'm, I'm happy with my sizing. I think a small fit well for me. Do -do -do. So next I'm going to show you guys this one piece bikini. So the one piece bikini, did I really just say that? <laughs> so this is called the Kylie one piece in the print candy cane. By the way, I'm obsessed with the print candy cane. Uh, do you guys see how cute it is? They have a lot of other bikinis in this and I wish I got more, but you know, huh. You get what you get, you know. I saw this on Instagram. It's literally so cute. I saw it, I was like, I have to have it. The print is adorable, first of all. The back comes down really low, and it's really cheeky too, and it just looked really flattering, and I was like, oh, since it's a more conservative front, it's okay that the back's a little bit, you know, edgy, you know what I'm saying? However, I ordered the wrong size for me. I looked at the website, and I was trying to like figure out my sizes, and I looked at the model photos and it was like model is 5'10 and we're size small. So I was like, oh, well, I'm 5'6, so I think a small should fit me. If no, I kind of forgot the fact that models are like 110 pounds and 5'10. Like, I don't. So I ordered a little bit too small. Just so you guys can relate to my dimensions, I am 5'6 and I'm around 120 to 125, if fluctuates. Around my bust area is a 32. Yeah, I think it'd be adorable if it fit me right, but since it didn't, it was a little bit awkward. My fault though. I just ordered the wrong size. <laughs> my heart though, because I would have worn this all the time. It's so cute, and the quality again is supreme. But anyway, here's a montage anyway. Enjoy. the Maui bottoms in the color blue soda it has some really cute detailing right here on the front I don't know if you guys can see but there's like a little stitching that goes across right here so what it says here is the seamless Maui bottom features a flattering and secure fit that hugs your hips in the right places this piece can be worn mid or high rise and I wear mine about mid rise but what I really like about this bathing suit is that it has a little bit more coverage up front so I feel like it makes my torso appear smaller and my legs appear longer, which I always am going for. So I really think this is a flattering bottom. And then the top that I got with it, I'm not sure what the name of this top is, but it's in the uh, blue soda color again. This one has adjustable arm straps and then the back is just a clip this time. And unfortunately, this was the one that I needed to be a little bit more adjustable because it's a little bit too tight on me. And the other ones, like the Tona Twist Top, fit fine. But this one, it was just a little bit too tight on my rib cage. It's definitely really stretchy, like, see? We'll see, I still think this is a really cute bathing suit and I'll probably be wearing it a lot this summer. Cute de montage. So this is a 
mango bikini. It's the last one I'm going to show you guys today. This is called the Missy Top. And it's just basically like a bandeau type of top. And unfortunately, this one was a little bit too small for me. I should have gotten a size medium with this one. But as you guys can see, the shape is really nice. It's flat across the bottom, and then it has a little curve up top, so it's really flattering. I've said flattering a million times in this video. I am sorry. And I got the moderate bottoms in the color mango. I wish I got the right size with this one, but just learn from me and make sure you like read the measurements or something. I don't know. I just guessed, and I'm stupid, so... <laughs> I absolutely love the color on this. I think this color is going to be really, really popular this summer. I've already been seeing it everywhere. Like, it looks really, really beautiful on deeper skin tones. And if you're tan, too, it looks great. And hey, Pale Girls, too, you can rock it. You can rock whatever you want. You know what I'm saying? Uh, cue the montage to this one. <laughs> enjoyed this video make sure that you give this video a thumbs up if you want more like it I do actually have a bikini haul that I will be releasing during the summer as well for more Zawful now that summer break I'm gonna be recording way more and I know I always say that but like guys I'm gonna record okay um, I'm making it my goal this summer so make sure that you tell your friends about my YouTube channel if you enjoy it and make sure that you comment tell me your thoughts below again follow my social media hit subscribe I hope that you guys have a fabulous day and I will see you soon bye